The Federal Trade Commission is announcing a major crackdown on fake charities, those charities that claim to help veterans and service members. Natasha Chen explains which fake groups were highlighted and how you can make sure your money is going to the right place. A coalition involving law enforcement, state attorneys general, and the Federal Trade Commission announced an unprecedented crackdown on charities preying on people who want to help veterans and service members. Help the Vets collected more than $20 million by claiming that donations would help veterans. But the FTC said 95% of that money went to help the vet's expenses, its fundraisers, and its founder. More than 100 law enforcement actions were taken on similar groups that have credible names, like the National Vietnam Veterans Foundation. When veterans came to them asking for support, instead of supporting them, they funded the needs of their friends and family members. And veterans of America made illegal robocalls asking for cars, boats, and real estate. But the FTC says the donations were just resold for the founder's profit. I'm here to warn scan artists, watch out. We're investigating complaints. We will track you down. This is something that's going to affect the life of you and your family. And someone wants to play games for their own personal gain. The FTC made this video to help Americans donate to worthy organizations. The agency says you should always ask for the full name of the group. Check that name with your Secretary of State, the Better Business Bureau, and other charity rating websites. Don't donate using wire transfers or prepaid cards. Consumers shouldn't be discouraged from giving. The message here today is that there are effective cops on the beat. In Washington, I'm Natasha Chen reporting. The FTC says spend more time doing research on a charity before you give your money.